Welcome to Startup Pack. I'm Spencer, and here at Startup Pack, we love to train software developers as well as build custom software solutions for companies. With over a decade of executive leadership as a fractional CTO and 25 years in software development, I've mastered transforming tech teams and products. So the AI emperor has no clothes, and Sam Altman just admitted it. While claiming that they can build AGI less than seven months ago, now they can't even keep their chatbot from feeling like an overworked secretary. So I'm going to dive into why OpenAI's collapse might be uh, take the entire AI industry down with it, and we've definitely seen some skittish stock over the last couple of days. So let's jump into some of these articles here and, and go through some of these. Now, this is an article from about a month ago, but I kind of wanted to just cover this really quickly because it says OpenAI may be in, in major trouble financially. And quote, I hypothesize a kind of subprime AI crisis brewing, right? Since OpenAI unleashed ChatGPT on the world two and a half years ago, the company has operated a substantial financial loss. So I talked about the beginning. Every dollar requires $2.25. So despite having raised at least $60.9 billion in private funding since ChatGPT's public launch. OpenAI is leaking billions of dollars every year. In 2024, for example, a tech startup lost $5 billion, right? Now, there's a lot of other things going on here, and I'm not going to dig through all of this because there's uh, other parts of this. But when it comes to OpenAI, it's difficult to see where else revenue is supposed to come from if not for rate hikes. So as we've talked about before, they can try to squeeze what they're giving you and give you less for the same dollar, or they can raise money. Now, raise the prices. Now, regular users have already been experiencing OpenAI's random throttling like in May when the company limited ChatGPT image requests because their GPUs were melting under the weight of their vast user base. Now, this is exactly what's going on. And what's going crazy, what's kind of crazy to me here is in January, Altman boldly claimed, and this is a quote, we are now confident we know how to build AGI. So this was the 2025, and this was part of when he was saying that ChatGPT 5 was coming out. Now, shareholder, shareholders were promised AGI was coming with ChatGPT 5, and the hype machine was in absolute overdrive. Now, the reality check is ChatGPT 5 and users have absolutely hated it, calling it cold and unfriendly. Who has liked it is corporates because it has become cold and unfriendly and more businesslike. So the interesting play here is clearly they're playing to corporations. So even Altman himself has admitted, though, we totally screwed up. Now, I'm kind of trying to figure out exactly what Altman's play here. Like, I get why he would claim false or not. I kind of understand his motivation money uh, for claiming in January why they had a path to AGI, right? So completely false, but I kind of understand what they're doing here, right? CEO's job is to be their number one salesman. But now I'm trying to kind of figure out why he's admitting that these are collapsing. I don't know if he's trying to just give everybody a heads up so we can see it'll be like, see, I told you. If you like this clip, make sure you check out the full Startup Pack live video here because we've got lots more for you today.